Talking tonight about Chicago's rich Latino culture, which extends from uh, lifestyle, cuisine, and of course music. All over the place. WGN's Annabella Val visits a spot in the Hermosa neighborhood that's preserving the rhythm of a culture. Every Saturday afternoon, you can hear a beat coming out of the church gym, and that beat has dozens of families making beautiful music together. One, two, one, two, three, four. It's a drum session like no other. Youthful hands, aged hands, all playing the congas together. This is El Ritmo School of Latin Percussion, and when you jam with them, you're part of a family. Try to set up the type of environment where fathers could come with their sons, mothers could come with their children, and, and um, really promote and um, teach culture. For a set of congas to take home today, where does bomba come from? Is that your final answer? Bomba comes from Puerto Rico. Michael Rodriguez Jr. started this percussion program two years ago as part of the ministry at Grace and Peace Community Church in the Hermosa neighborhood. He was hoping the instruments that once saved him from the streets would do the same for other young people in the area. Instead of getting high off of weed and beer and stuff like that, I just got high off of music. And I, I realized, like, wow, I don't need these things. You know, I, I could... Uh, find that bliss in, in, in music. There's so many uh, youth and young people and, and parents for that matter that are losing their children to the streets because they don't have anything to do. This is kind of an outlet, a safe haven for them to come in and, and do something that's positive. Class meets every Saturday for a two-hour session in this gym next to the church. Everyone plays together from day one. Michael works with them as a group and also one-on-one. -on -one. So I try to get them playing and having fun immediately. Students can learn to play as many as eight instruments included in Latin American percussion. No easy task if you ask Elsie Gonzalez, who already plays the timbales for a salsa band. She wants to learn to play other instruments and inspire her niece to do the same. My goal is to, you know what, to just bring the girls out there. Come on, I'm looking for the next Sheila E. Kianis is not sure if she will be the next timbales or conga queen, but she's willing to give it a try. I want to learn stuff new and like meet new people and like really enjoy it. Just you and your drum. There you go. There you All go. this fun and cultural education is completely free. Michael doesn't charge a dime for these classes. I'm not here to make money. I'm here to uh, spread our culture. I have a job. I got a good job, you know, I, I support my family. This, you know, this is something else. I want to make a difference. I don't want to make money. Whoa, that was good. The class is open enrollment, and Mike says he welcomes anyone from any part of the city to join them. He's also willing to take his lessons wherever needed. For more information on El Ritmo School of Latin Percussion, you can check out ritmoschool.com.